what is the largest organ in the human body? The options are heart, liver, skin or brain. And the correct answer is C that is skin. The skin is the body's largest organ, serving as a protective barrier against pathogens, regulating temperature and aiding in sensation. Question number 2. Which bone is often referred to as the funny bone? The options are humerus, radius, ulna or femur. And the correct answer is A that is humerus. The humerus bone located in the upper arm is often called the funny bone due to the tingling sensation felt when it is struck. Question number 3. Which of the following is not a function of the skeletal system? The options are support, protection, hormone production or moment. The correct answer is C that is hormone production. While bones do play a role in hormone regulation by releasing osteocalcin, they are not primarily responsible for hormone production. Question number 4. Dear friends, welcome back to our channel. And now you are attending the 100 most important and most repeated MCQs question answers based on human anatomy. And this is the part 1 of this series. And the next part will be uploaded tomorrow. Let's continue. And friends, if this video is helping you, then make sure to hit that subscribe button below. Your support means world to us. So don't miss out. Hit subscribe now and let's keep the journey going together. Question number 4. Which organ is responsible for filtering blood and producing urine? The options are liver, kidneys, pancreas or spleen. The correct answer is B that is kidneys. The kidneys filter waste products from the blood to produce urine, maintaining the body's fluid and electrolyte balance. Question number 5. What is the main function of red blood cells? The options are transporting oxygen, fighting infection, clotting blood or producing antibodies. And the correct answer is A that is transporting oxygen. Red blood cells contain hemoglobin which binds to oxygen in the lungs and carries it to tissues throughout the body. Question number 6. Which part of the brain is responsible for regulating balance and coordination? The options are Cerebrum Cerebellum Brainstem or Thalamus. The correct answer is B that is cerebellum. The cerebellum located at the back of the brain coordinates voluntary movements and maintaining and maintains balance and posture. Question number 7. What is the smallest bone in the human body? Your options are stapes, tibia, femur or radius. The correct answer is A that is stapes. The stapes, also known as stirrup, is located in the middle ear and it is involved in this transmission of sound vibrations. Question number 8. Which muscle is responsible for breathing? The options are diaphragm, biceps, quadriceps or hamstrings. The correct answer is A that is diaphragm. The diaphragm is a dome shaped muscle beneath the lungs that contracts and relaxes to facilitate breathing. Question number 9. What is the main function of the digestive system? The options are circulation, respiration, digestion or exhalation. The correct answer is C that is digestion. The digestive system breaks down food into nutrients that can be absorbed by the body and eliminates waste products. Question number 10. Which gland regulates metabolism? 
the options are adrenal gland thyroid gland pituitary gland or pancreas the correct answer is b that is thyroid gland the thyroid gland produces hormones that regulate metabolism energy production and growth and development question number 11 which blood vessels carries oxygenated blood away from the heart? The options are pulmonary artery, pulmonary vein, aorta or vena cava. The correct answer is C that is aorta. The aorta is the largest artery in the body and carries oxygenated blood from the heart to the rest of the body. Question number 12. Which of the following is not a function of the respiratory system? The options are gas exchange, regulation of pH, digestion or, or vocalization. The correct answer is C that is digestion. The respiratory system is responsible for gas exchange, regulation of pH and vocalization but it is not involved in digestion. Question number 13. What is the name of the tube that connects the throat to the stomach? The options are esophagus, trachea, branchus or larynx. The correct answer is A that is esophagus. The esophagus is a muscular tube that transports food from the throat to the stomach through a series of contractions called peristalsis. Question number 14. Which of the following is not a type of muscle tissue? The options are skeletal, cardiac, nervous or smooth. The correct answer is C that is nervous. The muscle tissue includes skeletal, cardiac and smooth muscles which are responsible for movement, heart contractions and organ function respectively. Question number 15. Which structure is responsible for producing insulin? The options are liver, pancreas, gallbladder or spleen. And the correct answer is B that is pancreas. The pancreas produces insulin, a hormone that regulates blood sugar levels by facilitating the uptake of glucose into cells. Question number 16. Which part of the brain is responsible for processing sensory information? The options are cerebrum, cerebellum, brainstem or Thalamus. The correct answer is D that is thalamus. The thalamus relays sensory signals to the cerebral cortex and is involved in processing and relaying sensory information to the other parts of the brain. Question number 17. Which bone forms the forehead? The options are mandible, maxilla, frontal bone or occipital bone and the correct answer is C that is frontal bone. The frontal bone forms the forehead and the upper part of the eye sockets contributing to the structure of the skull. Question number 18. Which of the following is not a function of lymphatic system? The options are transporting nutrients filtering lymph, fighting infection or absorbing fats. The correct answer is A that is transporting nutrients. While the lymphatic system plays a role in filtering lymph, fighting infection and absorbing fats, it is not primarily responsible for it is not primarily responsible for transporting nutrients. Question number 19. Which organ stores bile produced by the liver? The options are gallbladder, 
pancreas, spleen or appendix? The correct answer is A that is gall bladder. The gall bladder stores bile produced by the liver and releases it into the small intestine to aid in the digestion of fats. Question number 20. Which of the following bones is not a part of the axial skeleton? The options are skull, rib cage, vertebrae or scapula. The correct answer is D that is scapula. The scapula is the part of the appendicular skeleton while the axial skeleton consists of the skull, rib cage and vertebrae. Question number 21. What is the main function of white blood cells? The options are carrying oxygen, fighting infection, clotting blood or producing antibodies. And the correct answer is B that is fighting infection. White blood cells or leukocytes are the body's primary defense against infection, pathogens and foreign invaders. Question number 22. Which of the following is not a part of the central nervous system? The options are brain, spinal cord, peripheral nerves or retina. The correct answer is C that is peripheral nerves. The central nervous system consists of the brain and spinal cord while the peripheral nervous system includes the nerves that extend from the central nervous system to the rest of the body. Question number 23. This structure connects the kidneys to the bladder. The options are urethra, ureteris, renal arteries or renal veins. And the correct answer is B that is ureters. The ureters are long, narrow tubes that carry urine from the kidneys to the bladder for storage and eventual elimination. Question number 24. Which of the following is not a function of the integumentary system? The options are regulating blood temperature, producing vitamin D, sensation, or producing hormones? The correct answer is D that is producing hormones. While the integumentary system plays a role in regulating body temperature, producing vitamin D and sensation, it is not primarily responsible for producing hormones. Question number 25. Which structure connects the two hemisphere of the brain? The options are corpus callosum, cerebellum, brainstem or hypothalamus. The correct answer is A that is corpus callosum. The corpus callosum is a thick band of nerve fibers that connects the left and right hemispheres of the brain, allowing them to communicate and coordinate functions. So dear friends, it's the time to comment your score out of 25 questions. So let us see what is your score out of 25 questions. Please comment your score. And if the video was helpful, then please comment your view on this video. And do support us by liking and subscribing and sharing our channel, our videos. So thank you so much for watching and wish you good luck for your upcoming exams.